Hey everyone, welcome. Hey everyone, welcome to another part of Let's Play Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, guest starring Lord Lamo as Steven Stills. As I like to call it, it's Vingar! Merg! Steven Stills is still trying to get his band sex for bomb well known, but due to all these ninjas and a bitchy guitar player, it hasn't happened yet. So he's gonna stop off in this tiny restaurant known as the Frying Dingle. Hello, lady person. I would like some of your oddly named Japanese dishes. Thank you. I also have um some ramen. No, it's ramen. That is that is how you say the word. Ha <laughs> ha. I am yanking your feet. Ah no, that falls. Ah, pulling balls. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> you know, at least I got off standing where I was in front of it. But anyway, we head this way. Enter another Freddie Mercury birthday party. <laughs> Bad pig. You had to see the people's elbow because you were a terrible piggy. People didn't like you. You originated swine flu. I love how dejected the box look when you take all the money and like, You took everything I own! My family's gonna die in a ditch poor because of you, Steven Steels! Steven Steels. <laughs> This little piggy went to market, this little piggy got kicked in the face! Wee! The booyaka punch never fails me. Oh. Ah! Oh god! Ah! Stop with the swords, guys! Seriously, what did I ever do to you other than kill your thousands of ninja comrades? Uh, I figure I might, might as well point this out now. If you want to unlock um, Mr. Chow or Chow or whatever the hell his name is, you have to beat level 4 first, then just keep doing random levels and eventually he'll, like, reappear somewhere on the map. And you only get one shot at fighting, so don't die while you do it or else, well, you have to keep doing levels again until he reappears and reappears and reappears. It's annoying, stupid, and tedious, but who gives a crap? I don't. Because I have too much free time. And punch. Let Mark in this exercise maneuver at kids the roll and punch, roll and punch, roll and punch, double uppercut. How did you get off that explodey boss, kid? Yes, thank you for the victory sign. I appreciate it, that is. I always like a victory sign when I'm beating up the ninjas. And this chick. Take that. Lurk. Ow! This is a turn up. Ah, you turn up, lantern. We don't belong in this world. Me and my bamboo stick are gonna go avenge the unjust. Ah, oh god, red ninjas. Ah, black ninjas. Oh god, all manner of ninjas. Kick. Oh god, ah, 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 wah, punch. Also makes you can block the sword, which it just seems odd to me. You just hold up your arm and you're like, ow, ow, stop cutting into my arm flesh. It's succulent and meaty. Mean my sword. We go for another rainbow road door. This one is clear. I don't care much for you piggies today, so you get to live. La la! Hoo ha! And then we arrive in Ramona's backyard. Now it's pretty easy to spot, but this is the hammer. It has plus two against girls, or so the comic would have you believe. Hey! It's Roxanne Richter! Richter, I don't give a shit. Hammer time! <laughs> hammer time, bitch! Don't stop hammer time! Ow! Bitch really doesn't want it to be hammer time! I met some outdated reference, lady, but come on! Hammer time is synonymous with the cool! Ah! Oh god, stop! Steven Stills doesn't like this development! Help me! Ah! Oh god! Urgh. Ah! Ah! Jesus! Urgh. Steven Stills is a moment to your shit, lady! Ah! 
Come on, bitch. Ah! Oh god! Dirk! Hammer time! Oh, I just have to kill her with a hammer now, just for principle's sake. You don't fuck the hammer! Pain in the ass. Explode into animals already. Thank you. That's very adorable and cuddly. What do you got to say, Gideon? Thanks. Come on, Gideon the cat. Let's party until we are beschnickered. Let's warp tunnel away. I'm gonna miss him. What the hell is this animal bullshit? Oh! It was a perfect world, they die when they fail. Just like. Explode into goopiness. Alright, we're on to stage 5, the Halloween party. Which is where we fight the twins. And that's what. Wow, you guys are Asian looking. Hey, aren't you that girl that's supposed to be my girlfriend? Ugh, that's what you get. Go for here and you reach yet another subspace highway. This is the... Well... Let's go. Corridor highway. I imagine this is probably a reference to, um... Gideon picking up Scott's memories of his school life. It's a pretty nice touch, but, you know... I don't care. I just, I'm just here to punch blocks and get money. I'm just saying, if you're a homeless guy and you go to see Scott Pilgrim, you're, you're probably going to end up like stabbing people and thinking they explode into coins, which is not a bad thing, because admittedly, homeless people going on a nut a not so rampage hitting people and hoping they turn into coins would be hilarious, but, you know. It's dangerous enough going out at night as it is without homeless stabby people. Hey, Beach Ball! Party, guys! Skullhead! How you doing, man? Love that game you were in by Tim Schafer. Be in more of those. Not you, Pumpkinhead Jack. I don't like you. What? What is it? What? What's going on? I don't see anything. Eh, it's been a false alarm. Robot Crate! It's Robot Jennings! You can tell it's Jennings because he's wearing a funky suit. That's it. Beer keg beat down time. Yeah, it's Jennings. He's tired already as well. Merk. Did someone say hockey stick? Because I said hockey stick. And now we meet the first boss of this level. Robot O1. He's relatively small. And adorable. Come over here, robot. Come here. Come on. Good robot. That was easy. La la la. Hey, Gideon. What are you doing back there? Oh, no. Oh, oh, you're suddenly too cool to talk to me? Come back here, Gideon. Sign me for a record deal. I know you've got a record company. Come on, man. Don't let Steven Stills down. Steven Stills has never wronged you in any way possible. Ow! Me and my above average band are here to kick ass and take names. But mostly me, because one's too busy chatting up a woman and the other one's too busy being... Well... Pretty much an amalgamation of Chie from Persona 4 and a fan service character. But who's taking account anyway? Oh, this game is lagging quite severely. This is the first time I've played it on, like, the, um, recording start setting. Also, if you go in here, you can get another shop run by Scott's parents. I would like a tropical punch to go, please, and I will also have a filet mignon. Thank you. Come on, filet mignon. Thank you very much. You're raising a fine kid, Mr. and Mrs. Hogan. Excuse me! The quest for vengeance has begun. That's a robot arm. Ah, uh, crap. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. 
I don't want to die. My bad hasn't made it big yet. Oh crap, oh crap. Ah, you get out of my way, guys. Oh shit. Oh, ah. That's when you know it's a good party, when the surrounding neighborhood is burning in a horrible hailstorm. Maximum size, eh? You don't look like Tank and Top of Gurren Lagan. Hell, you don't even look like Mazinger friggin' K! So don't pretend you're the biggest robot in the world. Hell, one Booyaka Punch takes down your hand. That's the might of Steven Stills and his determination to get his bad promoter- Oh god, laser. Ow. Bring it on. Bring it on. Come on. Come on. Bring the pain. Mm. Bring the pain! Mm. Come on, where's the pain? I want the pain! Bring it to me! Bring me the pain! Ow! You did I get hurt before you even fired the beam! The residual beam got me. The pre-beam beam got me. Oh yeah. Ow! But you're laughing up there in your robot cockpit. Oh god, it breathes fire. That's a brief fire! There. I did it. Not so tough about your robots, are you? Hey, get back here! My, this is... Asian. Yeah. So manly, I liquidate statues. Chuck Norris looks under the bed for Stephen Stills at night. Because Stephen Stills is manly as hell. Although in the comics he did piss all. He actually never fought. He never did anything other than, you know, play guitar and sing. And be a vegan. I think he was a vegan. I don't care. It's odd. I complain about it not being that good. It's so-so. I wouldn't say I'm a fan of it, but I've, I read it through and through. And yet I know all these annoying little details about it. Alright, I think now's about a good time to cut off, so me and Steven Stills will see you again here next time.